live in our own little world. Both of us have forever. We don't like, like, the typical rock music thing, like the scene, and we don't, we don't feel a part of anything. We are in our own world, totally. I mean, it, as far as we're concerned, the Beatles and the birds are on the top of the charts, you know, or whatever. And, uh... Plus, we just get along. Yeah, you know, because we've been in bands and there's always problems with people and we don't ever have personality problems or ego problems or that crap. See, I think that's weird because we're like friends and we're basically just nice, normal people that all, and we just are friends. That's why we do it together. It's easy. It's the most easy thing in the world. All we wanted to do was make records from the beginning, like make records like we used to listen to in our bedrooms, you know? And, and to go tour in England, uh, or to have records come out there and stuff like that is just magical and mysterious and incredible to us. So, uh, we're like the luckiest people in the world, you know, when it comes down to it. We figured out which labels would, would have us or whatever and, uh, Because uh, he buys every fanzine ever printed, every fanzine in the and every universe. record and everything. So, so he knows we knew all what was going on, you know. And we sent a bunch of tapes over, um, and just they responded. That was all. That, and well, the other thing too is that, you know, we really hate like the typical workings of a rock band. All the typical putting together of the dumb bio with the stupid group photo and all that bullshit, you know. And we so we didn't do it. We. Uh, we, I just wrote nice letters and drew little cartoons and stuff like that, and I think that they actually, that's, you know, something that they, that hits closer to home with somebody, you know, it's more personal, and in that instance, well, we got response from everybody. They actually yeah. listened to our songs over there and said they, they liked them. We sent tapes out here, too, but nobody bothered to say anything about them, so. Not at the time. Now they are all of a sudden, you know, that they're finding out. After that they hear something's going on, then they're interested. Yeah, so they're interested all of a sudden. Not in the step one. So uh, we've had, at, to this point, had more success in England or whatever without even, you know, doing much of anything. It's all a Chinese hype. It is a hype.